If you like our video, click the button to subscribe to our channel and get easy access to new content. To see our full suite of ad-free video courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides, visit us at www.teachucomp.com. If you work on specific jobs for customers and need to track amounts spent and earned by job, you may want to set your job defaults. To access the job defaults in Sage 50 Accounting, select Maintain, Default Information, Jobs from the menu bar. To set the general default job settings, click the General tab. To enable warnings if line items are not assigned to jobs, check either or both the For a Customer Transaction and For a Vendor Transaction checkboxes. To set the default job statuses, click the Statuses tab. There are four job statuses provided by default and you can add more if needed. To add a new job status, click the Add New button. Select an icon color from the icon dropdown, and then enter a name in the name field. To make it the default job status, check the Use as Default checkbox. Then click the Save button to save it into the job status list to the right. To delete a job status from this list, click it to select it and then click the Delete button. To change its position in this list, click it to select it, and then click the Move Up or Move Down buttons. To create up to five default custom fields for jobs, click the Custom Fields tab, then enter the names of the fields into the Field Labels fields, and check the Enabled checkbox to the right of the fields. After defining the custom fields here, you can later enter the specific values for each job record. To save the job defaults after changing them, click the OK button in the Job Defaults window. Remember to click the Subscribe button to see more of our videos. See our full suite of courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides at www.teachucomp.com.